Hello everyone in YouTube lads, I the Collector here to bring you a new raid. Today we're going to be fighting the Ultra Beast Katana, which is currently weak to Steel and Fire. It is an Ultra Beast from the Sun and Moon series and there are currently five of us to try and take it down. Let's see if we can take it down and how hard it's going to be. Okay, so at the first we've got Charizard. Let's see how Charizard does. There is Katana. As said, it is a Grass and Steel type. So fire is going to be double effective. You know, if I could have... Um... No, Charizard, Charizard, he's still in there. Good, Charizard's still in there. Uh, Chandelure, Mega Charizard are also in the ring. Uh, turning around to see what also as well. Yep, Mega Charizard is there. Chandelure is there. Both are fire types and that is quite good. But no, uh, no, Katana is Razor Leaf and Leaf Blade is gone. No, and... I owe two aim using a Chandelure. Chandelure is hanging in there by a Fred. Fire overheat. No. Chandelure is down. There's a shiny Charizard in the ring. That's good. Bla shiny Blaziken is here. Currently, there were five of us trying to take it on. And no, Blaziken is down. No, Blaziken is hanging in there. Let's see if Blast Burn can do anything. Calm down move. No. Okay. Blaziken is down. Uh, we have Blaziken 2.0. Another Blast Burn. I don't think you can get Mega Blaziken. Nope, there is a Ho-Ho now in the ring. All right, and we have Flareon joining us as well. So predominantly a good team of fire types. There are 224 seconds on the clock. Arcanine's now there. We've nearly beaten it. So as you can see, we've got a party of five and it's down with two 13 seconds left to spare. The only question is, how hard is it going to be to capture well, that's what we're going to find out. So let's see what we get for winning. First of all, we get five Golden Raspberries, 1,100 Stardust, one Charged TM, one Fast TM, 18 Hyper Potions, no Revives. Okay, so um, Red Dragon got the final strike with uh, Charizard. I managed to get the award for being the most stylish. And Beth and Luke, who I've no idea who they are, launched seven charged attacks. So that's good. We currently have 19 Pokeballs to try and capture it. Let's see how we do. Okay, that is not good. It's very far away. Okay, we are not off to... A... Okay, I think Curveballs are not... No... Oh, first hit of the day. This is not easy to hit. And it didn't even stay in the ball for a second. That is not good at all. Golden Razzing. Okay. Doesn't look like we're going to get it, but friends. <sighs> no. <sighs> Come on. Yes, we've got it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I did not expect us to catch it. I thought it was going to break out. I thought it was going to be one of those things. Look how small and tidy it is. That was not a fun thing to try and capture. Okay, so at the moment we've got Air Slash and, Air Slash and Night Slash. Very slashy. Let's just check the IV. IV is not that good. But anyway, so, okay, so that is how you try and um, deal with Katana. So to summarize, uh, fighting is going, it's weak against fighting, exceptionally weak against fire. As you saw, we used a combination of Chandelure, Charizards, and Flareon and Blaziken to take it down. And as you saw, it was not fun to try and capture. Okay, everyone, well, that is the collector on how to catch Katana. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things Pokemon, Dinosaur, and Yu-Gi-Oh! content, and Digimon as well. I'm The Collector, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all soon.